Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today is going to be a slightly different video because I'll just be doing a day in my life as an accountant and I actually came to the office today because I just wanted to avoid the heat. Um, and what I mean by this is right now Vancouver is going through a really intense heat wave and it's supposed to go all the way up to 41 degrees Celsius and I believe that's around 105 degree Fahrenheit which is like insane because Vancouver never gets this hot like the hottest it will ever be is like 30 degrees if we're lucky if we want like a really nice summer but it has never been the case where it's been this um this hot and so I've been suffering the past couple of days at home over the weekend where I couldn't do anything it was just so hot that I couldn't function and I was like not prepared for the heat wave at all. I think I checked the weather on Friday just before the weekend and I was just wondering like why is it so hot and I noticed that the temperature was going to increase over the weekend and I was like not prepared whatsoever. I just have like one little fan in my room and most places in or most homes in Vancouver I should say don't have AC because we don't generally need AC for the summer because maybe we will get that like one off day where it's really hot and so when I like searched online to buy you know a, like a mini air conditioner or just like any sort of fan like they were all sold out and the other day when I went to a, the grocery store to get some ice all the ice has been sold out so like everyone in Vancouver is in the same boat and today I was actually really lucky to have booked this office because everybody seemed to have the same thought of coming into the office and you know being in AC and so I like woke up really early I woke up at 6 took transit and came to the office and had to go through the, uh, the hassle of you know checking myself in and you know why is my car not working and all that and so finally I'm able to sit down here and get some work done and um, have a peace of mind that I'm just gonna be in this nice cool little place the whole day and actually be productive because I have been nothing but you know unproductive the past couple of days and I really wanted to get a video out this weekend but I just couldn't get myself to sit down and uh, film because I would literally be sweating the moment I start talking and I can't have like the fan in the background because it will like interfere with the sound and so this is my intern video in between and my next video will be on tasks of a tax accountant, senior accountant or senior tax associate uh, version. So look forward to that. But in the meantime, here is a day in my life of an accountant as a tax manager. So this is my current setup. I'm not going to be showing you guys obviously anything confidential, but I have like two laptops set up because the half day I'm going to be doing some firm work and half day I'll be doing some clients to common work. And so I had to bring two laptops with me to work, um, which is fine because uh, I just took a bus that's like right across from where I live and it was you know pretty convenient and then just around here this is basically the office that I'm in it's like the same as last time okay so I'm actually just gonna get coffee right now and it's like one of the things I miss about coming to work I brought my little coffee or my little water bottle here and I had coffee already in the morning but because I woke up so early today I think I need another cup of coffee to get me going through the day so I'll take you guys along So that was a little bit of a fail because I thought they still had the ground coffee machines. We used to call the coffee machine Frankie because it's like to the level where you get it at the coffee shops, like the full on machine. But it seemed like it's off limits right now. It's all being taped up. And so I decided to get like the inferior coffee, which is like the packets that you uh, put into the machines that are on every floor. And that also didn't seem to work because you need a cup that would fit under it and I have like a huge water bottle so obviously it doesn't fit under it and there's like no cups or anything 
um, available so you would have basically had to bring your own cup to drink coffee and I didn't bring my own cup so it's okay like I had my coffee this morning and I'm gonna go out during lunch to get maybe another cup of caffeine of some sort it's been a while since I woke up at 6 I'm not gonna lie like um, I'm pretty tired but I'll get through it. So I'm just going through my emails right now and emails it's like a constant battle you can never really get your inbox to zero every single morning you have like a new batch of emails that you have to filter through and, and then obviously throughout the day you also get new emails as well and not only do I have my own like inbox for the firm but obviously I have an inbox for the clients to comment so I have like a ton of emails I always have to go through and then obviously like my personal emails I have um, a bunch of emails there so it's literally a fight against the emails so I'm super hungry because I just had a shake in the morning and I, it's hard for me to focus right now so I think I'm gonna grab a little snack there is actually a coffee shop downstairs with really good pastries so I think I might grab myself some sort of drink as well as a snack into a meeting so I couldn't get my snack and I'm starving so I think I'm gonna run out to actually just get my regular lunch uh, there's this place across the street called Freshy and it's really good in terms of like healthy um, simple meals multitask so eat while working okay I just finished lunch I was like working and eating at the same time and there's this term in Korean where it says like I don't know if it's going through my nose or going to my mouth because you're not really focused on eating you're just like eating because you have to and then you're focusing on work so you don't really get to like taste the food or anything and so I just like gobbled down my lunch and then now that I somewhat have my firm work kind of under control I'll be jumping into my secondment work and I'll just be going through the emails and checking and catching myself up to what happened in the past week because I go on these client secondments about once a week now we're just wrapping up the project that we're doing and so there's not as much things for me to do compared to the beginning where there were like a lot of things so i'm just wrapping things up just catching up on emails and it's already 1 p.m so let's see how that goes so you guys are probably just sick of me showing you of me sitting in this office uh but you know i really can't show you any of the confidential information that i have and so this is Basically all you guys will see of me working all day and my coffee break. So what I'm going to do is it's currently 3.40 and I think I need a little bit of a pick me up. So I'm going to go downstairs and grab myself a little snack and a drink and then get back to work. my favorite which is oreo and caramel and so yeah it's just really refreshing on um this extremely extremely hot day i, I thought i was like melting outside 
It was actually a, a bit of a fail because the coffee shop that I wanted to go to was actually closed. They closed at 3 p.m. So I just missed it by like an hour. It's currently 4 p.m. right now. And so that's why I decided to do a little detour and get an ice cream or a little McFlurry instead. So this is going to be my afternoon snack and then I'll eat this while I work. Hey guys, I'm just checking in with you right now. I didn't even realize that time was flying by. It is currently 7.20 and I still have a couple files that I need to wrap up. Since it's currently Canadian tax return busy season, since most um, companies with December 31st year ends, need to file their tax returns by June 30th. So that is what I'm trying to get done. At the same time, I'm in US tax. So there are a couple US tax returns that I am also working towards uh, with some internal deadlines, which I'm also trying to get out the door. And on top of that, I had half day clients to come in. So I'm literally juggling like three different things. Yeah, so it's just been a crazy day, but hopefully, you know, after June 30th, like a lot of these files will be wrapped up and I'll be on vacation for two weeks in July. So I'm really looking forward to that. But before I go, I really need to wrap up all these files so that I could rest peacefully while I'm on break. So. Hey guys, so I think I'm going to end my vlog here. It is currently 8 p.m. on the dot and I think I'm gonna head home soon. And yeah, it's just been a long day. You can see that I'm in disarray right now just because today went by in a flash and with deadlines coming a lot of the work gets pushed to managers and uh, senior managers at the near the end of the timeline so there were a couple things I need to get done which I was able to so tomorrow is going to be a bit of a lighter day and yeah I think I'm going to be taking uber and expensing it because I did the late to do work and then yeah and then go home and edit this video for you guys hope you guys enjoyed my video today and if you guys did like my video please uh, like and subscribe so that i can post more videos like this and if you guys have any questions about what it's like to be a tax accountant or if your experience going back to the office is sort of similar to mine comment down below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye Thank you.